Jal, I'm in the meeting room. Right behind you, Ryder. Pulling up the message. Jal Amadarav, you always were a short-sighted fool. Helping an outsider instead of your own people. You're unfit to bear your family's name. I didn't mean to make my enemies yours. Mm -hmm. He said similar things before. When we were students, the Moshai paired us together. We've never gotten along. I'm still learning about Angara, but that sounded more personal than a childhood rivalry. He's too smart to attack me directly. Aksul wants us to do something reckless. Let's not give him the satisfaction. Ryder, he's got Pock. She's broken, though. Guess Kalinda didn't take very good care of her. Hey, I don't want any trouble. I found this site abandoned. By scavenger law, it's all mine. Yeah, right. You made that up. Um, scavenger law? Scavengers get to make up the laws? No, then you could just make up new ones. <clears throat> well, I'm a businessman, you see, so I'm willing to sell if you see anything you like. Did you see where the crew that used this site went? No. They were trouble, though. Led by a pain in the ass Asari with a mean as spit Krogan toady. They've been picking remnant sites clean all over. Never leave anything worthwhile behind. But, uh, they screwed up and left some choice items here, though. How much for that broken observer? What, this thing? Yeah, it may look trashed, but I assure you it's easy to fix right up. In fact, I could do it myself and make a killing, so, uh, no discounts. Right. This guy's gonna put her back together. You ever hear of an Asari named Kalinda Terev? That's the, uh, pain in the ass Asari I stupidly mentioned. <sighs> Please don't tell her I called her that, or next time I see her, it's my ass. Yeah? So you better do right by us. Let's get down to business. Okay, look, what do you think is fair for the Observer? Take this, and consider yourself lucky. Yep, that'll do. Pleasure doing business with you. I'll get her to the Tempest and put her together. Thank you, Ryder. Maybe this Kalinda nightmare is over. Don't start going naive on me, PB. <sighs> yeah. Regardless, I can upgrade my remnant scanner now. Come see me back at the ship. There you are. Hi. Okay, who stole PB and put you in her clothes? Not funny. It's a little funny. Okay, it's a little funny. I received this. Hey, babe. Sorry I broke your pet. It lacked versatility. Couldn't keep up? Maybe I'll do the same with your other new toy. Ta. She means you. I hate her. Really? Are you sure about that? Oh, I don't know. It's not that she took my bot and broke her. We got Pock back and I repaired her. Better than ever. Now my scanner's fully upgraded and sweeping the cluster for remnant signals. We won. So what's the problem? It's just... drummed up feelings I thought I'd put behind me. Turns out I just buried them. This is what happens when you let people in. You acquire baggage. I travel light, damn it. No baggage. You have every right to be upset. Yeah, but at who? I let Kalinda become important to me, and I should have known better. Now you've become, or you're becoming, important. But you need to know, I resist checking out of this hotel every day. With accommodations like these, I don't blame you. You are funny. I just need a little space. Time to think. Hopefully, my now Remtech-infused scanner will pick up something amazing and make all this Kalinda trouble worthwhile. You more than anyone know how dangerous Axul is. <sighs> Why were they allowed to speak with him? They aren't children anymore. We can't control their every move. You remember how you were. Please, Jal. <sighs> I'll bring them home. Are you okay? Three of my brothers and sisters have joined the Roka. Aksul has poisoned them with his hatred of aliens. And your mothers want you to bring them back. The Roka have made camp at the forge. Many consider it the birthplace 
of our civilization. Aksul likely believes this bold move will create more fanatics for his cause. Ryder, he has my family. But I don't think I can do this alone. You don't have to. Just tell me the time and place. Hmm. No hesitation. You are a good friend. I have a contact who's been monitoring the Roka. I'll set up a rendezvous with her. Jal, you sure you want me here? Bringing an outsider. Did our mother send this human, too? Jal, you didn't tell me your sister was such a badass. Your people are a joke. Tevint, please. Why'd they send you? Because we've lost enough to the kid. They're afraid to lose you to this insane cause. But, Jal... I want you to meet my friend, Scott. So you can see that Axul is wrong. We need to work together against the cat. We're here to stay. I want to get along. Who cares? The Angara don't want anything you have. We don't need you. Jal, our mothers want us to live truth. It's because I love my mother that I will die for this Axul cause. is going to blow this place up. That's why I sent the researchers away. Stop. He has bombs. Talking. Stolen from your people. Those bombs go off. It'll look like the Initiative did it. We have to disarm them. Give it! No, 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 no. The bombs in the forge. I'm okay, Jal. I'll be fine. You gonna make it? I hate Axul. Don't let him win. You got it. I'm glad you're here. Jal! Jal! I killed Lathul! I killed him! I'm so sorry! He's not dead. You are lucky. I lost my mind, Jal. I want to go home. But the cause. I joined because of you. I shot our brother. Don't leave Let me. her go. I only want soldiers who are committed to our cause. Not weaklings who stand by and watch the destruction of our people at the hands of aliens. You recruit kids and make them fight their family. It's sick, and so are you. I speak for our people, and I say, you're done, Ryder, Helios. <laughs> Martyr me. Please. I dare you. I made a promise to my friend that you're making really hard to keep.
They move onto our planets. They take our resources, make us weak. I've watched Ryder make planets habitable. Exactly. And they'll never let us forget he it. He rescued your beloved Morsai. I know. Saved her life. I know. Stop defending them. The Moshai trusts Ryder. And stop. We've been fighting the wrong enemy. Maybe the enemy is this traitor. Easy. Jaw? Don't. The Moshai trusts Ryder. You've become a danger to your own people. Walk away. Or I kill you and reveal the resistance for the traitors they are. I'm so sorry, Lafu. I never... Couldn't even kill me at short range. <laughs> They are here. Let's give them a minute. Thank you for trusting me. Killing Aksul would have made the Rokar stronger. He shot you. I'm glad he did. It exposed how far he'd fallen. It could have gone badly. I knew what I was doing. <laughs> You've been practicing. A little. We should get back. I want to say goodbye before my family heads home. Damn it, Sid. What's going on? I get influence with power players, only to have it squandered by a sister calling in favors under my name. Do you know she got the genome for... Oh, what is it? Cats, pulled from storage. One, there's no place to grow anything right now. Two, it seems they aren't even a food. So why? Lots of people love cats. They make them happy. I don't think we're in a position to put amusement over necessities. She just doesn't think. Tries to help everyone, damn the consequences. And she thinks what we do is so exciting, but doesn't really understand what it takes. Because what we do is exciting. We make people's lives better. You make it sound so wonderful. We see some real shit. But we don't quit. Because what we do matters. It does, doesn't it? Even on the worst days, knowing we make a difference. To make a difference is probably all Sid wants. But what if she gets herself into another mess? What if she gets hurt? She'll have you to watch her back. I hate it when you're right. She's going to go her own way, no matter what I do. If she does it without my help, she'll run into even worse trouble. Thanks for helping me with this. I swear, my sister isn't going to drag us into an ambush again. Hey there, what's new? Huh? Funny you should ask. I need to know, if I had something really important to do, could I count on you to help, to come along? If it's as exciting as you make it sound. It's pretty damned exciting. Thanks to my newly remnant augmented scanner, I'm onto something big. Hear that signal? 
Best I can tell, it's coming from a piece of raw remnant programming tech. A building block in an unused state. My eyes bulge thinking what we might be able to learn from it, or do with it. It's like a rem tech wild card. The kind of mystery I live for. I have to get it. There's no time to waste, right? What are the implications of this device, whatever it is? At the very least, it'll strengthen our bridge to remnant technology. Even just getting closer data readings could help us break down remnant programming, use their tech more efficiently. I need to find it. Like, now. Well, now that now's gone, so... now. Okay. That's it? No preamble, no further interrogations, just okay? You're in? I'm in. Yes! That your game means the world to me. Loading the coordinates into the galaxy map. Consider me primed and ready. Where's PB? Haven't seen her. Wake up, PB. Your mystery signal awaits. Uh, right. Okay, yeah. Actually, could you come here, please? My place. Straight away? <sighs> Callow. Hey, any luck finding a place to land? Nothing yet. Might take a while. Okay, PB, be right there. This'll be interesting. PB? Back here. I won't bite. What's this about? Kala won't find a safe place to land the Tempest. And safety first! You keep me on my toes, PB. That's one way to put it. I'm not doing this for the fun of it. The Tempest can't go where we need to be, and you can't get there from the ground. This is the only way in. In? Where exactly are we going? PB, where are we going? It's not my fault the signal's coming from inside a volcano. And we should land on stable ground, assuming my subterranean scans are accurate. And the impact doesn't alter trajectory too severely. And, and tell me you have a plan for getting back to the Tempest. Is that a thing? We came all the way to another galaxy with no plan for getting back home. All right, brace for impact. So, uh, are you mad, Ryder? <sighs> I'm not mad, PB. guys does she have? Kalinda's about to get the device. And as she goes. You won't make it, Kalinda. Too late, gal. It's mine. Damn it.
Hey, stranger. How you doing? I don't know. Can you explain what happened down there? I mean, Kalinda has been nothing but trouble, I grant you that. But why did you stop me from saving her? I know you two were once close, but she was a user, PB. Who knows what she might have done? Couldn't take the chance. I appreciate that. It's complicated, I know. It's just... Desperate times bring out one's true colors, Ryder. I could have seen Kalinda's, even if it only confirmed the obvious. Will you be all right? I will. Eventually. Don't worry. In the meantime, I have this thing to occupy my thoughts, huh? I was right. It's raw, unused programming tech. With time, I can make it upload specs of our design into remnant hardware. A true fusion of both technologies. My first real mark in Andromeda, and I have you to thank. We do have a little bookkeeping matter to discuss. Ah, oh, nuts. Yeah, the Tempest is light, one escape pod. That's gonna cost me, isn't it? Next time we dock at Nexus, you buy a new one. If you don't have the funds, you work it off over time. Got it? Hey, I'm the one out of bedroom. What do we do about that? Didn't you say you can sleep anywhere? Oh, you're no fun. Hey, PB. Hold that thought. Sit tight. Uh, I'll be right back. Hello. Don't worry. I'm not springing anything terrible on you. Actually, you be the judge. So, you and your team are like a fungus, you know? You look and smell funny and you grow in the weirdest places. And somehow, you found root in my... Oh, it's so corny to say. In my heart. Ugh. I'm recording this so when I get antsy, and believe me, I will, just sit my ass down and play it. Shut up, PB free card. Now, if there's anything you'd like to preserve for posterity, say it at the beep. Oh, and then join me in the meeting room? Um... Beep. Welcome to the team, PB. Glad you've decided to stay. So, um, the reason I wanted to talk to you all... Uh-oh. Did you mutiny and jettison, Ryder? Uh, no such luck. He just showed up. She did ambush me. But I survived. No harm, no foul, huh? I just want to say... Whether you all know it or not, I've had one foot out the door since I got here. And, well, that's gonna stop. I'm proud and happy to be part of this team. This... family. That... that's really it. Uh, okay? About time you caught up, kid. Yeah, you're one of us, whether you like it or not. Well, great. So, uh, my place is an utter mess. Who wants to help me clean it up? Think I left the stove on. I'm making ice. It's an ungodden holiday. Reports don't file themselves. Helping Liam make ice. But... but... 